My name is Hunter Symes, the president of the Mayport Coastal Sciences FFA chapter. I am excited to introduce you to our Living to Serve environmental project funded by CSX. This year we are conducting a scientific research of the Sherman's Creek tributaries. We have three goals. One, to provide accurate real-time data to our community partners JU, UNF, and the Riverkeeper. Our second goal is to assist our students, families, and community to create a true connection with the St. Johns River. And lastly, our third goal is to help create a positive change in our community and how we interact with the environment. Welcome to site one of the Living to Serve Environmental Research Project. This, um, right now we're out here, it looks like we have some activity over there, you see the water move? Um, we are going to be researching the water quality at this site, it's high tide right now, so we're gonna have to pay attention to the tide chart and come out during low tide tide um, at this time but this is a great site you can see where the two creeks are merging together we're going to take some water quality data and monitor the macro and microorganisms that are abundant in the site so here we are at the research, research site number two that is across from Shangri-La Drive and we have a really good access here to the creek bed Okay, this is our research site number three, which we're, for, we're closer to the intersection between A1A and uh, Mayport. But we chose this site because it's closer to the business sections of A1A, specifically the um, uh, gas station and the coin laundry, and it's very close to some homes there. So we're gonna check the water quality here and uh, check on how, how uh, that affects the upper part of the creek that we are monitoring.